Hi, sixth graders. I'm Teacher Oz. Welcome to our first lesson in English for this school year 2021-2022. Isn't it exciting? Yes. So, everyone is welcome to attend this English class. Let's start. So, I hope your answer sheet and your pens are all ready before having our examples. So, for today, we'll be having this lesson. Title, Rear or Make Believe, or Fact or Non-Fact Images. Remember, images portray visual perception of persons, plays, events, animals, things, and the like. These images may be real or make believe depending on the context they signify. They are also highly available everywhere, so you can see these images anywhere. Let's proceed. These images can be found in books, newspapers, magazines, mobile phones, television, or other online sources via internet. So all of these images can be seen anywhere. Now, let us have more examples. Let's do this. Are you familiar with the two photos on this screen? Both images are taken from the 2018 Disney Pixar's Incredibles 2 animated fantasy film. I have two questions here. The first one is, which of these images can be considered real? The second question is, which image is just a make-believe? And why do you say so? Now let's think about it. You're right. The first image is a real image. And the second image is a make-believe image. Now, what are the fact images? This is a type of image which shows real images like the image or photos of your friends, visuals of objects or happenings that exist in real life like the birthdays, actual and stolen photos of people, nature, and objects like this hamburger, yum, and even the photos of animals. They are all fact images. The second one is non-fact images. Make-believe images like this, wedding on a unicorn, and not real object like Darna and Spider-Man do not exist in real life. We also have symbols of our mind or on images. We have the fairy tales of books, the fantasy or magical world, and even any product of imagination. Now, let's do this activity because it's activity time. Our first activity tells us to put a check if it is shows reality or factual elements and put a cross mark if it is a make-believe or non-fact. First item, a motorcycle. Number two image is a young Superman. Number three, a crying heart. Four, roses. Number five, a fairy and a virus. Six, vegetables. Seven, is a smiling kite. Eight, a hen. Nine, a mug. Number ten, image of two trees. 
Are you done? Now let's proceed with activity two. Write capital T if the statement is fact or real, and F if the statement is a make-believe or non-fact. One, social distancing is the best way to prevent the spread of the coronavirus. Two, people have more time with their family during the quarantine. Three, sun is the center of the universe. Four, social gathering is one of the causes of the fast spread of the coronavirus. Five, energy opposes motion. Six, it is alright to talk closely to others if they don't appear sick. 7. COVID-19 was created by a witch. 8. Currently, there is no vaccine or treatment for COVID-19. 9. The government gives cash assistance to the needy Filipinos. 10. Proper hand washing should last for 20 seconds. Are you done? Congratulations if you have finished answering the Activity 1 and 2. Now, let's check. I have prepared some guide for you guys. For Activity 1, here are the answers. 1. Check 2. Cross. 3. Cross. And 4. Check. 5. Cross. 6. Check. 7. Cross. 9. Check. 8. I mean 8. Check. 9 and 10. They are check. Those are the answers for Activity 1. Now, here are the answers for Activity 2. 1. T. 2. T. 3. T. 4. T. And 5. M. Where T stands for true and F for false. T stands for fact and F for non-fact. Number 6 F, 7 F, 8 F, 9 T, and 10 T. Where F stands for make-believe or non-fact and T stands for fact or real. So they are the answers for activity 2. Now, you're done in this module. Always remember that real images actually exist or do happen. They are not imaginary, fake, nor artificial. A make-believe is based on imagination, not real, and could not happen. Fact is an actual idea that exists. It is provable, observable, and measurable. Non-fuck is something that is intentionally good for this item. Congratulations and see you on our next activity. For now, this is Teacher Ross saying good luck and God bless and